it's important in clogging to learn how to do double overs because as you work your way up through the intermediate steps, they come into all kinds of steps and you want to be able to keep your balance and keep the right timing. So I'm going to show you a three count crossover. It's a double step with your left. You're going to double toe over your other foot, double toe over, and click. I'm going to double out to the side and click, double click. So you want to be able to do that with precision and timing. Double click, double click, double click, double click. Those are double overs, okay? Now double step. Now you want to be able to do it with the left foot too. Double toe over, double toe out, double toe over, double out, double click, double click, double click, double click. And you always want to click or slide or produce a hop or some kind of sound on that downbeat. So starting with your left, do a double step. We're going to do a series of double over and double out. Double over, double out, double over, double out, double over, double out, double over, and then double step. Now let's try with the left. Double over, double out, double over, double out, double over, double out, double over, double step. One and a two and a three and a four and a five and a six and a seven and a eight. Right foot, same thing. And a one, and a two, and a three, and a four, and a five, and a six, and a seven, and a eight. Those would be double overs. So it's important to learn those because they are a part of so many other steps in clogging that not only start a lot of steps with a three count crossover, which is double step, double over, double out, or right foot leading, double step, double over, double out, and that's three counts. And a one, and a two, and a three. And a one, and a two, and a three. So they not only start other steps, but they're also in the middle or at the end of other steps. So it's important to learn how to do your double toe overs with good timing and good sound.